Packers. The St. Nicholas Greek Orthodox Bake Sale, it's here. We have a sneak peek. We were holding it up just a second ago. If you weren't watching, you're missing out. But we're going to show you everything you can expect. Please welcome Helen Poole and Denise Iliadis. She is, uh, they both are organizers. Join us now. I'm going through your little book here, The Popular Greek Recipes. If you haven't seen this, you need to stop by and pick this up. This is quite the item right here. So this bake sale is, is a big annual deal for y'all. The money raised, uh, how does it help y'all out? It helps us maintain our church. How difficult is that? <laughs> well, um, the church has been there for a while, so mm. we, yeah, we have a lot to take care of with I was going to say outside stuff, uh, mm -hmm. just fixing up the place, making yeah. sure renovations are on, on key. Um, what goes into this bake sale itself? I mean, we're here, I'll hold it up again. And uh, I mean, this is like traditional food we're talking about. We I see baklava, we have the, uh, the braided Easter loaves and things along those lines. Why is it so important for this to be here in South Texas? The ladies of the Delphi Club at St. Nicholas uh, prepare all of the pastries every year um, during Easter, and um, we. What is your favorite on here? How about that? <laughs> my favorite is the baklava. <laughs> is the baklava? Everybody's <laughs> favorite. No, my favorite is the kaludia, the butter twist cookies. Why? Why is that? Because they're not as sweet. They're not as sweet. Yeah, they, they're they just, good with coffee. They hit the right notes. Exactly. Um, for people that want to show up for this event, um, when is it? Uh, where? How to get involved? It is um, down at the Greek Church, 502 Chaparral, sure. uh -huh. and it's um, Thursday and Friday, the 6th and 7th. On Thursday, we'll be there from 7.30 a.m. to 6 p.m. You can come before or after work, and then on Friday from 7.30 to noon, but we normally run out, so. So go early. Yes. Okay. Don't miss out. We have the information on the screen. Uh, how long does it take to prepare all this food? We start preparing in February. Mm -hmm. So uh, that we, long, I mean, week. so we're not talking about, well, how, explain that, how is that? You start in <laughs> February, a couple of months go by, and here we are in April. Uh, what keeps this fresh, I guess, is my question. I mean, because the baklava the, looks very, very fresh. Right, we, uh, we, we prepare them, and then we freeze them. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then the bread, the last week, we prepare the breads. Right. Okay, that we would bake be my, them. My right, we're making some more today. It smells yeah. so great, and it's so fresh. Mm -hmm. So, mm, ladies, we appreciate you all coming in. Popular Greek recipes, this looks like a good book. I might keep this for myself. <laughs> Get back to him. Uh, thank you for coming in. Wish you a lot of success uh, with your big sale this thank year. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.